I'm your review guide and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing and first impressions of the Vizio V-Series 5.1 surround system. And if at any point during the video you guys want to go check out the Vizio V-Series for yourself, I put Amazon links down below for the US, UK, and Canada. You do know I got you guys, but let's get into this unboxing. Now, this is a 5.1 sound system. So what that means is that there's going to be a sound bar as well as a subwoofer and two little surround sound tweeter speakers. So getting this thing unboxed right now, we cut all the tape off of it. It folds to the front. All right, so on the top, I think this is where the mini two surround sound speakers are going to be. It does say left and right. So let's put that off to the side right now and look through the rest of the box. One thing that I do love about unboxing this is everything is conveniently labeled. This is obviously the cable box, and I do also like the instructions of which way to open it so you do not open the box upside down. All right, now let's get this subwoofer unboxed first. Again, great packaging. It is a common theme with Vizio. And wow, this is a very clean design. Right off the back, before we even get this fully unwrapped, you can see they got nice high quality rubber pads at the bottom of this. When it does vibrate from the subwoofer, it will not shake the floor and make a really awful sound. So I really appreciate the thickness and plushness of these rubber pads, they are gonna do a good job. Now you get the on and off switch back here for turning this on and off. Really nice tactile button, as well as the left and right for the surround sound little speakers, as well as the power port right here. But again, really like the style of the subwoofer, really minimalistic and clean. I'll give you guys a little bit of a turnaround right here. Very clean, the branding is only on the top, so if you do not like brands sticking out all over the place, Vizio made it really minimalistic and not in your face. All right, so this is the Vizio V-Series soundbar. So you got the power button right here. Again, really tactile, nice buttons. I'm guessing this is to switch inputs, Bluetooth, and volume down and volume up. Again, very sleek and minimalistic design. You got the Vizio logo right over here in the corner. A great thing is it doesn't look, it's going to keep fingerprints. After you press it, the fingerprints disappear. So a really nice design on Vizio's part. Let's turn this thing around and show you guys the inputs. So on this side, you do have the power input right here. And then going over here, you peel this tag off. Then you're gonna get your HDMI arc, optical audio out, aux VA, and regular aux. And as you can see with the logos in the back, this does have Dolby audio and the true surround sound. So I'm really excited to try this thing out for you guys. So let's get the little two surround sound speakers out and complete this whole set so I can set this thing up for you guys and give you a first impression. Okay, so unboxing the two little surround sound speakers. Again, great packaging, completely wrapped and folded nicely. And you got that extra high quality foam there as well. So getting these unwrapped, again, same exact design as the other parts of this set. Got the Vizio logo right here anti-fingerprint material at the top, and you've got nice little rubber feet at the bottom, so if it does shake, you aren't gonna get that annoying vibrating sound. Nice quality fabric at the top. Again, these are pretty lightweight, but they are not cheap feeling. They definitely do feel pretty high quality, even though you're paying under 200 bucks for a whole 5.1 surround sound system. All right, so we got the sound bar, two little surround sound speakers, and the subwoofer, but let me get out the cable for you guys to show you what this whole set exactly comes with, and if you're gonna have to buy cables for yourself. All right, so the first thing I have to say about this box is just, wow. They give you a lot of cables, and by the first look of it, it doesn't seem like you're gonna have to buy anything for this set. You have mounting brackets here for the sound bar and what it looks like the, those little two surround sound speakers. They even give you batteries for the remote. And the remote, I have to say, looks pretty good. Let's get this thing unboxed right away. All right, so you got that little Vizio logo down at the bottom. So remove this little tab right here. Very minimalistic remote, but it looks like it's gonna give you everything that you're gonna need for this. Inputs, Bluetooth mode, power on, EQ levels, effects, setup, mute button, up and down volume buttons. And the quality of this remote honestly isn't bad. I mean, it is completely plastic, but it looks like something might look light up at the top, so I am really excited to see that. And the buttons are in nice, coated rubber. Got the optical cables. You got the little guide down here. Power cables, as well as the cables to plug in the mini surround sound speakers to the subwoofer. So whether you wanna have this stationary on a table or mount this, Vizio does provide you with everything you're gonna need, no matter how you wanna customize your setup. So that is all that comes with the V-Series Vizio 5.1 surround system. I really love the design and they give you everything you're gonna need, no matter how you wanna set this thing up. But now that I've given you guys the full unboxing experience of the V-Series, 
let's get this thing plugged into the Hisense U8G and give you guys an overall sound test for 200 bucks for a 5.1 system. All right, so I got the Vizio V-Series 5.1 system hooked up to the Hisense U8G. So in terms of setting up the Vizio V-Series, it is pretty self-explanatory. The guide that Vizio gives you actually does a really good job of telling you how to set this thing up. Now I set this up in front mode, which means that these two surround sound speakers are in the front right next to the sound bar. Now, if you do have mounts, you can't put them in the back. You just have to go into the remote and change the surround sound mode. I did have to do a little bit of adjusting, get the sync perfect on my TV and the sound bar. But after that, again, it works pretty dang well. But now I'm gonna give you guys a sound test and my impressions of the Vizio V series 5.1 audio system. So right off the bat, there is a very good amount of bass in this system. There is an equalizer built in. So if you do want to adjust the bass trebles and mids, you can go in there with the remote and adjust those manually. But there is a very good amount of bass coming from the subwoofer and in terms of directional sound. The two mini surround sound speakers and the sound bar are doing a very good job of tracking the audio from the left side to the right side of the screen. This is around a $200 5.1 surround sound system, so it's definitely a huge upgrade from the TV speakers. It has really good spatial awareness and can mimic the overhead sounds of airplanes very well, as you guys could hear from the spaceship flying overhead in the Dolby Audio sound test. So there was the sound test in terms of surround sound. The V-Series definitely does not lack in the bass category you can definitely feel the low vibrations in movies and surround sound content. Overall, for a $200 5.1 system, this does a very good job and is a huge upgrade from internal TV speakers. But now that I've done the surround sound test for you guys, let's get some music on these speakers. The best way that I can describe the sound for you guys is a full sound. In with music, I do have to add, it does a really good job of balancing the sound from the left front speaker, the sound bar, and the right. So I don't know exactly what's getting picked up in my microphone, but I do have to say the bass quality in this $200 5.1 system definitely surpassed my expectations. If you have not had a 5.1 system, designated subwoofers definitely take your audio listening experience to the next level. So just for my unboxing, and first initial impressions of the Vizio V series, would I recommend it? 100%, $200, I don't think you can find anything better for a soundbar 5.1 system. But again, if you do wanna go check out the Vizio V series for yourself, either brand new or renewed on Amazon, I put links down below in the description for your convenience. And keep an eye out on my channel, I will be doing a full comprehensive review of the soundbar where I go into the equalizer, different modes, and just an overall living experience with the Vizio V series. But I really hope this video helped you out. If it did, it'd be awesome if you could hit that like button or that subscribe button, but I was your review guide and I'll see you in the next video.